the Cop City referendum has been approved. After two weeks of stalling from the city where they rejected the petition for minor infractions that they could have fixed themselves, they have finally approved the petition as of Wednesday, June 21st. Of course, it was approved only hours after they were sued over the delays. So now the timer has started and there's only 60 days to get over 70,000 signatures in the city of Atlanta, meaning it will probably end around August 20th or August 19th. As a reminder, you must be registered to vote and currently living in the city of Atlanta, and you had to have been registered to vote in the 2021 mayoral elections in order to sign a petition. This is a correction from a previous video where I said it was a 2022 election. It is actually the 2021 election that you had to be registered to vote for. And a canvasser will help you figure out when you were registered to see if you qualify to sign a petition. Also, it's important to note that you have to have someone witness you sign a petition who is also a City of Atlanta resident. They don't have to be registered to vote, but they do have to reside in the city. But don't let this discourage you if you are not a City of Atlanta resident. You can still help out by partnering up with a City of Atlanta resident to collect signatures and also by donating money. All info on how to get involved is on the CopCityVote.com website, link in the bio. You can have canvassing events to sign up for, a link to donate, and information on how you can sign a petition yourself, including permanent locations where you can go and sign. So the clock is ticking. 60 days goes a lot faster than you think, so make sure to get involved as soon as you can. Go to CopCityVote.com to get involved.